An electroencephalogram, also known as an EEG, is a test used to detect abnormalities related to electrical activity of the brain. Electro refers to electrical impulses sent from one nerve cell to another. These electric signals are the way the nerves transmit information to the brain. Encephalo refers to head. And gram refers to the printed record. A German physiologist and psychiatrist Hans Berger recorded the first EEG on a human in 1924. EEG exams are done by putting electrodes, which are small metal discs that detect electricity on the scalp. These electrodes send the information through thin wires to a computer screen or a piece of paper. The goal of the EEG is to mimic or produce the experience that the patient needs. Because of this, the doctors might ask patients to look into a bright light or breathe deeply. An EEG determines if the patient's level of alertness is normal, if abnormalities exist in one specific part of the brain, if the patient has a tendency to have seizures or convulsions, and if a patient is likely to have a particular kind of epilepsy. EEGs are non-invasive and do not involve any x-rays, radiations, or injections. EEGs have been used for many years and are considered safe. When an EEG is done, no electricity is put in or taken from the patient. EEGs are becoming commercially available for only a couple hundred dollars. You can use these to see how focused you are, what your level of attention is, if you're drifting away, and how relaxed you are, all in real time. I found this very interesting and I hope you do too. Thanks for watching and have a nice day. Come check out my blog at maraminutes.blogspot.com.